Hello, um, I am Sharjan Lukos, Head of uh, School for Simulation and Senior Marine. Welcome to South Shields Marine School Maritime Simulation Center. We have simulation centers spread across the site within the school. This is where we house the full mission bridge and engine room simulator used for the emergency response exercise this time. My name is John Christie. I'm responsible for the engine room simulator for the uh, emergency exercise. In, this is the uh, engine control room. In the engine control room we've got a 440 volt switchboards and on the right hand side here we've got our engine controls. As well as the engine controls we have power management system, pump controls and an overview of the entire plant. In addition, we've got communications with the bridge, um, both standard communications and emergency communications. Out in the engine room, we have two deck levels of engine room with realistic uh, conditions, and we're going to have all that now. This is the first floor of the engine room. In the uh, engine room, we have local operating stations, and on each operating station, there is a dedicated system so that if we want to come out and pump bilges or operate any part of the plant that we would normally operate from the engine room, this is where we come to. This is a typical mimic diagram of our propeller uh, gear and lube oil system. To operate uh, any of the systems, we have local control um, and all the valves as well are operated from these panels. Through this door we have a, another space that is the uh, steering gear and emergency generator room. I'll have a look in there now. Um, this is a steering gear system. The ship's equipped with uh, twin rudders. If we need to go to local emergency steering, we can uh, change over to local and then I can operate the solenoids to drive the steering gear to port or to starboard. This is the first floor of the engine room. On this deck level, we have fuel oil purification, uh, air conditioning. Uh, compressed air systems, refrigeration systems, diesel generators and our main engines. Uh, it's a twin screw vessel so we have two main engines. In addition to uh, mimic diagrams we also have 3D uh, graphics. With the 3D graphics we can walk around the engines and have a look what's happening in the engine room. And of course if we need to do anything on the engine such as sound in the sump uh, find the oil level in the sump, we can do that. And if we need to operate the diesel engines, we can go to the local control panel and we can operate, um, stop, start, uh, put it onto remote control, etc. This is the instructor station where we control the exercise from. In here we can see what the uh, operators are looking at and how they're operating the plant. And we can also observe with CCTV the engine room and of course we can see what's happening on the bridge 